So here we are in the Princess Theater once again, off the coast of Nicaragua. I've invited a few people to come by, sit with us, as we wait for our tour to leave. We are Pink Nine today. We're going to Granada, among other things. So we're down to deck three again. Gonna board the water shuttle, which used to be known as a tender boat, which used to be known as a lifeboat. So, but now it's a water shuttle. Water shuttle. Stay on the carpet. Never leave the carpet. Want to sit on top? If we get there in time. Oh, look at that. Moving up and down. Moving up and down. And jump! She made it. And Jan's coming. Wait. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, she made it. San Juan del Sur, Nicaragua. <laughs> Nicaragua. Sandinista. <laughs> they are really filling this tub up. And that guy, I put on Instagram. And now he's on YouTube. Christ the Redeemer statue, I don't know what it's called, but apparently it's the second largest in the world after um, the one in Rio. So we're up to uh, shore, and now we're not going to jump out of the sand. We're going to get out of this dock here. So we're officially in Nicaragua. Hola. And the music stopped. And the dancing stopped. Are you searching our bags? Hi. Hi. You can buy stuff right here in the port. Or you could get a tour right here in the port. But we're gonna head to a bus. Number nine? Number nine? Number nine? So we're on the bus in San Juan del Sur, Nicaragua, leaving the port. And as soon as you leave the port, one million, two million. Yeah, the road's a little bumpy already. Hello, good morning, my friends. And now our guide's talking. How are you today? And that's our guide. That's good, I can see a big smile on your faces. Oh, it's about to come to Nicaragua. Starbucks! So that's our guide talking. Well, we have a good coffee. We're right? driving through we town. We see what happened with Starbucks. This and town coffee is, is nice very and clean. Good. Hey, Barbara. Very good. Nice and clean. And right now in I mean, Nicaragua, many bars things on everything, of course. Uh, happening. We've got but, more tourists coming. That is very good and very But no trash. And we've got another new businesses. Street. No For example, Marvin, he recommended so me a brand new business in Nicaragua. Sleepy little uh, seaside town. Boy, I wish he'd quit talking uh, though. No offense. Hooters, yeah. Hooters. <laughs> he told me chicken, chicken wings and things like that. But we'll see, right? We'll see. It's a hostel. In Nicaragua, we have, my friends, 68 volcanoes. 
That's a lot. Yeah. 68, 68 volcanoes in Nicaragua. Active volcano, right? 25 active. That's a lot. Very you know, quickly, we got went down on his bicycle, up out of town. And he broke a world speed break. Fewer houses and a thick jungle, dense jungle. See right. that? Well, we'll reach and to an area of farms and ranches. Like swim, it's like corn sir, growing like right there. Like and it's all the way around. Everything. That's what tourists really enjoy. That's sesame, guys, and you're right. Sesame, yes. Sesame. This is over there is sesame. In this cows, area, we've got a lot of sesame. Goats. Uh, we're set up for some sort of festival or something, or maybe they're just getting ready for Christmas. I'm not sure. I think we're pretty close to our first stop, though. So we got off the bus, and there's this guy being videotaped by me. There's a lot of people. Are we meeting or just going? Pink nine. Are we just on our own then? Okay, thanks. As soon as you get away from the main thing, it's very quiet and empty. And they've all been waiting for us. You Morning. can tell they're excited. Hi. So if you want an old Florida license plate, they have those. Look at these things. Fancy hammocks. Guitars, cigars, not so fancy hammocks. Hi. Shot glasses, paintings, little dresses. Let's see over here. So I don't know, this was like a fort or something maybe. By the way, it's nice and cool. There's a breeze blowing. So I'm outside of it now. Came in through there and walked around a little. Lots of people selling the same thing. This one's a little fancier. We got bathrooms here. Women's obviously has a line. Guys, Verones. Uh, no line. Of course, no privacy either because the door's wide open, but so what? Right? Got some jewelry here. I think that says $10. I think that says 5 It's just a beaded bracelet, though. 15 They do have these but I don't know how well they work. And of course, knives. I don't think they let you bring them on the ship. Fans, letters. I'm not sure how much a letter is. Uh, I will say everything here seems to be cheaper than it was in Costa Rica yesterday. Costa Rica stuff was expensive. Of course, the stuff I looked at. Look at these. Ah. Bracelets, hacky sack, drums, dolls, wood. And time to go back. Painting. Got a lot of those. 
there is a fried chicken place. Tip top, that's the best brand of fried chicken in Nicaragua. Tip top. No. <laughs> We're heading out of town now. So this is the entrance to the volcano. They call it Vulcan Messiah. And of course we got a bus in front of us. So there you can see the lava now. And plumeria trees. Yes, that's why they cross the Lots and lots of plumeria trees. Big ones. See them off in the distance. This is Messiah Volcano. As you can see, it's lava. No trees up here. A lot of this grass. Probably non-native grass though, right? Grass is taking over the world. Oh, it's smoking. It's a smoking over there. Look at the birds diving in. This way a little bit. Watch where you're going. I'm gonna talk about uneven. This is uneven. I guess with all the smoke there, or steam, doesn't smell though. I thought it would smell. This one, why? Oh, not our guy. Now you can see down. Way down there. Those are vultures right there. Ooh, look how the color is changing. I smell it finally. Their picture taken. Here's Janet. Here's the landslide area. Don't enter. You were asking about that? There's a lookout up there. Do you want to go up? Looks like some people went all the way up there. We're going to go up to that lookout real quick. So we've got 15 minutes. Got some people coming down. This guy's in charge. You can tell. El Jefe. Horsey. So we came up the trail there and there's a road and I see now that it goes around to the parking lot. So the paved road might be easier, a little longer. Hey, yeah, I'm breathing hard. <laughs> She's almost here. Say, I think that's tents over there. I'm gonna say this is not a better view if you wanna look down in the volcano. If you want to see the countryside though, it is. You see the smoke there blowing around different directions. You can go up that path to the top of Messiah Volcano. I guess this isn't Messiah Volcano. But we don't have time. Our bus is leaving in 10 minutes, so. Too bad. To go to the next stop. You can see the flat plain out there. So Janet thought this might be a bathroom, and in fact it is. Check it out. Oh, there goes a our dining spot. 
El Filete, El Filete. And they reached it before us, so they're all eating and drinking beer. And it looks like a buffet, and it's table two. pretty okay. I guess I should have taken a picture of it. We had to serve ourselves and it was rice and beans and macaroni salad and a little piece of fish and a little piece of chicken and a little piece of I don't know if it was beef or pork. It was in gravy. Now we're headed to the city of Granada. Well, we just passed a sign back there that said Granada. There was a statue of a horse and carriage for some reason, I don't know. That looks like a baseball stadium. He said baseball is the national sport here. And that's a gas station. And gas is... 29.84 they call them Cordobas or something so just a little bit less than a dollar per liter welcome to Granada my friends so we're driving to the Central Park he keeps saying This is right the front of cathedral, that? I guess. Yeah, that's our cathedral here. In the left side, that's Salteva. That's the indigenous church. The one in the right side, that little fence, that was like the street limit. I mean. So we are in Granada. There's people blowing weird whistles. Oh, her. She's trying to sell them. And there's bird crap everywhere, so be careful. Where'd they go? Down this way? I don't know what you said. So look at all those old colonial buildings down there. I guess that's where we're headed. I think our group leader has taken off running <laughs> down here somewhere lots of activity here I just saw that out of the corner of my eye <laughs> miss it where we walk by looks like they're setting up a Christmas tree careful with that number nine number nine number nine Okay, so when you're walking here, watch out. They've had a lot of earthquakes. <laughs> and they have a lot of dogs. I'm not sure what his problem is. San Antonio College? <laughs> that sounds familiar. So the street is full of these kind of things and holes and plenty uneven. And it's also this. And this. This is the person who cleans up. Let's see old thing in the middle of the newer things. Well, it's nice and cool in here. 
Entry $20 Canadian. These guys are going to perform for us now. And I'm going to stand up here and watch. back of a folkloric show and I want you to see what's right over here yes they're right here in town hi and they're very nice and friendly and they have the watchtower oh. Missed it. Get that cello playing. The floor in here. Uh, screen printing press. I'm making T-shirts. So this must be art school. And these are some art projects. So here's another one. Okay, well, I can't get in there, so we'll just look at these. I see that. Tolerant infantilarte. As opposed to the shorter infant Alante. These don't look so tall. Plenty of flies though. Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse. Okay, so as we came out of the uh, museum slash art school, we found Kathy's Waffle House, home of breakfast and lunch. And there's our bus, and there's some police. And there's everybody taking pictures now. Steps and look in those doors. See other buildings, so oh, that's a volcano over there. Oh, hi. Okay. Thank you. I think I went in without paying those steps. And brings us to this place, which is probably more of the convent, right? Now there's little doors inside the big doors. And I saw somebody come out of one a minute ago. But this is Granada. And it's pretty hot. It's not very humid, but it's hot here. Those stairs don't go all the way down. So 
So don't go down this way. I have no idea how much they are. But we're on the bus again. Heading back to the ship. In San Juan del Sur. So it's gonna be an hour and a half or so drive. So goodbye to Granada. Or Casa Granada in this case. Granada, Nicaragua. So we're back to the uh, dock. Cool. And uh, we're getting ready to say adios to Nicaragua. So, from Nicaragua, see you in the next port. Bye.